what is going on welcome back to the channel today we're out in union illinois and we are at the rockabilly cafe the bebop rockabilly cafe never been here also it's the uh it's got a wild west town right behind right there behind me the bebop cafe is back over there um driven past here a bunch of times never been here though but uh it was just by chance i was actually just driving by and i saw that they're having a car show so i decided to stop in and see what's going on there's probably 50 60 cars here so not too bad so uh i guess let's get into it and see what showed up I like this. It reminds me of uh, Vanishing Point. It's on a drag radio, which is kind of cool. Grand Spalding Dodge. I mean, it's obviously not white, but uh, it's a little rough around the edges. I like it. Automatic car. You can see that. I like it, though. Got a little big tire S10 here. Small block NA. Automatic. It says on big tires. Really bars. It's called the Blackout. I've seen this car before at a different cruise night. It is very, very nice. The Super B. I would like to shoot this car actually. If I could find someone to uh, you know, take the uh, photos, I would definitely like to pick up with this guy. It's got a new, uh, as it says right here, it's third generation Hemi. It's got a new Hemi in it. It's a really nice car. It's really well done. I like all the bumpers are tucked in. They got rid of like all the bolts and stuff. It's just super smooth. All the emblems are shaved off. The fit and finish on it's pretty good. I mean, you look at all the gaps. Stuff. It looks pretty nice. Like it's a it's a well built car for sure. Drop top. Not a big convertible fan, but I think uh, this one looks pretty good. Oh, also the back. This tail panel. You can see it's out of like a new. I would assume it's like a Challenger. I think. I think it's a Challenger. Big body Bonneville, drop top, oh that is a lot of purple. That's a lot of purple. Look at all those gauges. I wonder if that's from the factory like that or if that's like vents and stuff. Not really sure. Body Money SS. Looks like it's at, it's at 87 or an 88. Gray interior. Nice. Nice. Yeah. Lay down spoiler. A lot nicer version of my car. <laughs> Zoomies. BDS blower, small block, oh, aluminum headed. No, that was last year. Something like that. 409. 
like this. Looks good. Four speed. That's cool. This guy, a couple years in the power store. I Means she's got some miles. It's good. Get out and drive them. That's an interesting car. I don't know if it'll come through, but it's like a yellow, green, white interior, four speed. GS Buick. Very interesting. Studebakers, you don't see a lot of those out. I forget what these are, like a hawk or something like that? I don't know, Speedster President. I don't know my Studebakers. I like them though. They're, uh, they're different, you know? President. Oh, this thing's wild. Looks like one of those Factory 5 chassis. It probably is. Oh, it is. Yep, it says Factory 5 right there. Oh, small block forward. Okay, that is not safe for work. These are cool. Looks old, but it's all new. I mean, the body, I think they even reproduced the body. Cobra just started up. I think there's a Cobra wheels. Yep. I did that. Like off in, of, uh, uh, I, when I, I oh, grabbed a, pork, uh, a buddy of mine lives over by Summit in Ohio. Yeah. And so he grabbed me a uh, he grabbed me a brand new ATK 302 sitting there on the uh, on the on the scratch and dent rack. Cougar Picked XR7. These are cool. Too. I do like these. It's kind of like the. Uh, Unloved Mustang. I think they look better than the Mustang of that year or era, I guess.
guy. I like it. I like it a lot. I like the way it sits. I like the wheels. It's good. Big black car. It says fuel injected big black. Automatic. Nice. Very clean. Good. It's very good. He's got slightly tinted windows. It says 427 on the air cleaner. Don't know if that's true or not, but it's definitely a big block. what this is. If it's an actual car, if it's a kit, or if it's a custom, I have no idea what this is. You guys know what this is? Post in the comments because I've never seen anything like this. It's windshield reminds me of like a old 30s Ford that's laid back like that with the metal surround. Looks like it's a fiberglass body. I guess it could be aluminum. I think it's fiberglass though. A big Continental, big block, AC, suicide doors, it's like a minty green paint with like an olive interior, it has 68, wow, still smells like an old car. Like an old car should. I actually want to get one of these only because they're copper. I want to polish one up. And we've got AC up in the corner here. gonna do it for here at the uh, Rockabilly Cafe car show pretty good turnout I'm really glad I stumbled across it it was really random that I came out here but uh, very glad I found it because I got to see some cars that I've never seen before got to hear a few start up that Cobra and that factory 5 truck that factory 5 truck is really nice uh, my favorite I think you already know the Impala that's that's my go-to on this one uh, that and that factory five truck, those are those are really nice. Um, that's it for now. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, all that stuff. We'll see you guys next time.